Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to talk to you about signing coaches over customers. I'm going to make a valid case for you and hope that you listen. My name is Mike Greenberg. Thank you so much for attending the Master Network Marketing. Why do we sign coaches over customers? I need to add people into my network. Do I consider a customer added into my network? No, I do not. I do not think that. I believe the people in my network are in my Peen Beach Body page. When it says these many people are my downline coaches, that's who I consider my business network is. I have two different networks. The network of what the overall training here is, is people that say they know me. That is my sphere of influence network. My business network is how many coaches do I have on my team. As of the time of this call, uh, I think we have about 5,200, 5,300 coaches on our team. Uh, so that is my network. If I'm adding them as customers, they are not in my network. Why should I be adding customers? No, I'm sorry. Why should I? Why should I be adding coaches over customers? Let me ask you a question. Do you have an elite or a premier goal? Do you know that you will only make points for a leader premier if they are a coach? Okay, you need 500 PV per coach that is a current year. So for example, at the time of this video, it's 2015. So that means that my 2015 only coaches are going to go into that PV goal. So if I do not sign coaches on a regular basis, even if they're just buying a challenge pack one time, that 35 PV, let's call it 50, let's call it 55 PV for easy math, times 10 equals one point. So for every 10 people, I've added one point. For every month that that coach stays active on Shakeology, that's 90 PV. So if I've signed five, that means every month essentially, or six, every month I'll get another point. If I'm not signing them as coaches, I'm not getting those points. That's for your Elite Premier uh, ranks. That's number one. Number two, the average time a coach stays active is 3.5 months. They taught us that at leadership. Why were we at leadership? Because we signed coaches. That's why we were at leadership. So because we were at leadership, they told us 3.5 months is the active. The active time a customer stays on Shakeology is zero months. That's the average, zero. They usually buy their challenge pack and that's it. Maybe a couple of them will stay active for one month, maybe two. We've never had that happen, so I don't know, I can't really speak more to that. But I can tell you that the average customer that buys a challenge pack, specifically just buys that challenge pack, and it ends there. So even just from a monetary standpoint, I will make an extra 9, 8, 27, 36, 360 team volume cycles on that person as a coach versus as a customer, which could equi which equivalent which is equivalent to almost 60 additional dollars in commission. So for every person you sign as a customer over a coach, you miss out on $60. I give people this analogy. There are so many different ways to get to Fort Lauderdale from Tennessee. There are many different ways. You could probably go up to New York, cut over and go back down and go around through Texas. I'm going to tell you that the best way to get from Knoxville to Fort Lauderdale is to get on I-75 South and head down. That's going to be the... Am I, mis am I misleading you by not telling you about I-95? Am I misleading you by not taking 441? No. You trust me, so you, I'm going to tell you the best way. The best way for you to get from Knoxville to Fort Lauderdale is take 75 South and go. That's going to be the best way. That's what I'm going to tell you. If you ask me another way, I'm going to tell you another way, but I'm telling you the best way. We all know the other ways to get Shakeology or these programs. eBay, Amazon, Bootleg, Friend family, Beachbody Direct. There's so many other avenues. They chose you. So they chose you as the best option. Your job is to sign them up the best way. It is a proven fact that it is cheaper to be on Shakeology as a member over a customer. Member over a customer is cheaper. If they don't want to stay on it, that's fine. We'll tell them how to cancel. I have specific scripts that I can give you that'll show them how to cancel. All right, guys? So this is something you really need to do. I would so much rather have a net gain of five coaches at the end of the month versus specifically me trying to think who my business builders are going to be. Oh, I only signed business builders and coaches. I'm here to tell you that our best business builders on this team were discount coaches that wanted nothing to do with a business. 
Nothing. So based on what my belief, a bit, every person I believe was a business builder has let us down. Okay? Remember that. When they call you and say, hey, I'm going to be a top 10 coach. Yeah, right. Prove it. Okay? But when they say, oh my gosh, I love Shake. I can't wait. I need to lose weight. That's my business builder right there. They just don't know it yet. So it's my job to get them into the challenge group. The other reason why I do it, and this is the last one for this video, is that I'm always going to be lurking, waiting for them to be in a be a coach. Oh, I'm lurking in my challenge group. Oh, you should be a coach. You should be a coach. So they're going, what else do you want from me? I already signed up for your program. Now you want something else. You're always wanting something. But if I sign them up correctly the first time, I can focus on their journey. I tell them, hey, you got a membership fee coming up. You got this, you got that. Make sure you cancel your coach account. We may change that verbiage with the new on-demand. As of right now, that's what we say. So that is something that you need to think about. I signed them up as a coach directly in the beginning. We call them members. I signed them up as a member from the beginning, and I don't need anything else from them. They already have their business open. Their smoothie business is open. It's open. They can make an absurd amount of money if they wanted to, or they could not make any money if they wanted to. The thing is, they are already signed up. Now they're starting to get results. Now I'm telling, hey, post on it. And now I'm looking at their page. Hey, Joanne liked your picture. Do you know that a coach account I sent you up with, if Joanne bought from you, if she bought 21 day fix from you, you'd make 40 bucks, which is essentially $40 off of your Shakeology. How would you like to get $40 off your Shakeology next month? Do you know if you were to get three people, it'd be free. Now I'm starting them on the journey to become a business builder. I am telling you, think about it. If you're one of our coaches on this video, there's a good chance that you started off as a discount coach and decided a business would come later. You did not think of a business from the beginning. Is that for all of you? No, it's not. But for the majority of you, we typically sign people that are interested in a journey and in a transformation. And then from there, they have molded into a business. Okay, so if I didn't sign you correctly, I can think of three people on the top of my head that are responsible for 60% of our income that had wanted nothing to do with a business. And if we wouldn't have signed them correctly, the couple of these people would not have been like, yeah, I'll do a coach. If they didn't want to do a coach from the beginning, there's a good chance they don't want to do it later. And I'm telling you the difference in our life would be, would be completely different. And the difference in their lives. Remember that. They didn't just change our lives. We helped change theirs. That's amazing to think about. Could they have found success other places? Sure they could have. I guess, but then we might as well go, is there only one right girl or right guy? You know, you can what if it to death. But because we signed them up correctly from day one,